I'd like to know where we stand. Why? Because for you, it's all about liberty, but for Dusty, it's all about you. And for you, it's all about Carly. No. No, I don't claim to be without fault, but I am here for you. And I'm here for liberty. I'm responsible for Brad not being here for her, so I'm doing the best I can to do what I think he would want me to do. Yes, Jack. You've done a wonderful job of caretaking. I'm also doing what I can to honor our marriage. That said, you're right. I don't want to see Carly hurt. Why? Because she's so fragile? You're afraid she's gonna drown her sorrows in a bottle of vodka? And you just couldn't live your, with yourself if that happened, right? Not if it were my fault, no. I know that you don't need me to help you get through Liberty's illness, but you asked for my help, and I promised I would. I just didn't realize it was gonna be such a huge sacrifice. It's just complicated. For you. Where would we all be if you weren't there to prop us up? Huh? We'd all just collapse. Me, Carly... I never said that. I can't worry about your feelings right now. My daughter is in the hospital fighting for her life. And I need everything I've got to be there for her. So if Dusty wants to be there for me as a friend, I am not going to justify it to anyone. Does that answer your question? Yeah, I think it does. Right on cue. Your handiwork? Seemed like a good idea at the time. deal with you right now. I need some time along with Janice so we can work things out. Sorry, Jack, that's not happening. I have waited for you to work things out for months, and something always gets in the way. I've had it. I have tried to be patient, but I stink at it. No, Carly, this time it's different. Yes, it is, because I'm not going anywhere. This is as much about me as it is about her. Excuse me? I have every right to be a part of this discussion. I don't think so. You okay? Dusty, stay out of it. Carly, you shouldn't be here. Greg. Don't answer it. Hey, am I the only person who remembers why I'm even in Minneapolis? I haven't forgotten. And my heart is breaking for you and Liberty. I don't know how you, you deal with a child with cancer. I don't want to know. But I have bent over backwards to make sure that we don't cause you any more pain. We. You and Jack. We have to stop pretending that everything is as it should be. It's not helping Liberty. It's not helping any of us. This, this situation is wrong. And it has to end now before more damage is done. There's nothing left to tell. Jack knows everything. You don't. Carly, don't. Yeah, bad idea. Neutral corners, everyone. No, we're all here. Let's clear the air. Thank you. It doesn't mean ganging up on Jack. No, wait. Go ahead. Finish what you started. What don't I know? Jack and I gave up everything for you. We swallowed our feelings. We put you first, and we did it willingly. Because your daughter was sick, and taking care of Liberty was the only thing that mattered. Carly. I thought I could live with that decision. I really did, because I thought you were loyal and honest. But you're not. You weren't Jack's faithful wife. You were Dusty's lover. Carly, that's enough. What do you mean when you say you gave up everything? We were back together. What? Jack was on his way to the farm to tell you. He was going to ask you for a divorce when you told him about Liberty's cancer. You asked him to stand by you, and Jack, being Jack, he did. Oh, my God. You knew, didn't you? Everybody knew except me. 
Janet, this is good. This is a good thing. Everything is out in the open. We can all get on with our lives. How? Dusty wants you. Jack wants me. We just shift. No, Carly, stop. No, that's not the way to do this. Well, if I left it up to the two of you, we'd all be miserable for the rest of our lives. I have an idea. No, that's enough. No. I don't want to hear any more ideas. All I want is for everyone to leave so I can talk to my wife. What do you want? I want you all to go. That includes you, too. That went well.